I'm Kyle Ford, Quattro brand mixologist, and today we're gonna to make a Strawberry Presidente Margarita. Now this is a cocktail that's all about the quality of ingredients. So we're gonna use fresh products and the finest liquor we can find. So first we're gonna start off actually with fresh strawberries. This drink calls for strawberries. We wanna put some fresh strawberries in there. So make sure you cut the tops off and then just kind of slice them in half. About two strawberries will do. Throw it into your shaker tin and muddle. Now you don't have to go crazy, just enough to kind of break them up and get the juice out of the berries. All right, now onto the liquid. First we're gonna start with Cointreau. Original triple sec, awesome orange flavor, a beautiful mix between bitter and sweet orange peels. So we're gonna add one ounce. That's the beauty of this drink too. It's all an ounce all across the board. So we're gonna add one ounce of Cointreau orange liqueur. To margarita, of course, we have to add tequila. So pick your favorite 100% de agave blanco tequila and add an ounce of that. Now this is a classy drink. We also get to uh, add a VSOP cognac to the mix. I prefer Remy Martin VSOP. And add one ounce of that. And again, lastly, the lime juice to complete the drink. We need some nice citric bite to this cocktail. So we're gonna add an ounce of fresh lime juice. Now you can squeeze this ahead of time as I've done here, but I'm actually gonna demonstrate for you real quick how you do this by hand. You just need one of these nifty little juice presses. You need to cut a lime in half and place the cut side down. Don't put it the other way around or you'll squirt yourself in the eye. Trust me, you don't wanna do that. So cut side down and you're gonna squeeze right into a measuring device if you like, but I can also let you know that about half a lime equals about half an ounce. Since we need a whole ounce, that's about a whole lime. But again, let's measure just to be consistent. A little nifty trick here too, as you're squeezing, if you turn it to the side, you'll get a little extra juice out of it. Waste not, want not. All right, we have all our ingredients in our shaker tin. The last thing to do is to add ice. All over the place. Give that a nice hard shake for about 10 seconds. Meanwhile, our cocktail glass has been chilling. I always like to serve in a cold glass. We now have to strain this out. You have two options here. You can actually fine strain this cocktail or just dump it straight into the glass. If you like a little bit of that fruit pulp in there from the strawberry, feel free to just strain normally. Otherwise, you can use one of these little mini tea strainers, little mini sieve, and actually run the cocktail through that. This will hold back all the pulp. Tricky part's getting all the liquid into the drink so you don't lose out on any of the cocktail. Give it a tap like that. Look at that, beautiful. Lastly, time for garnish. As a reminder of how fresh and awesome this cocktail is, we're just gonna add a nice little slice of strawberry. And the most important part of this whole process is to enjoy the cocktail. Strawberry Presidente Margarita, cheers. Mm -hmm.